friends, want to green up your summer? Well, I've got a really fun activity from our friends at WNET and their Cyber Chase Green It Up program. Today, we're going to make a little newspaper pot. And this way you can plant a seed and let it grow and then transplant it later on. And it's all biodegradable. So the first thing you'll need is just some newspaper, of course, some masking tape, some soil, and just a round object, could be a tin can, and then some seeds. So your first step is you're going to take your newspaper and you're gonna tear it about the width of your hand. So I'm gonna hold it down and rip, and you're gonna need two strips, just like that. Then you're going to layer them on top of each other, like so. And you'll take one of your cans and roll it right up. You want to leave a little bit of paper at the bottom edge. And you're going to just roll it right up. Roll, 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 roll. And then take a piece of tape, tape it down. And then at the bottom, you're going to fold it in like a little gift, just like this. It doesn't have to be perfect either, because eventually it's going to biodegrade, which basically means it's going to become a part of the soil around it. Might need another piece of tape, just like that. And then just slide out that can. And now you've got a little paper pot. Next, you want to take some soil. I just have some regular potting soil. Maybe your backyard has some soil that you can use. Of course, make sure that it's the right kind of soil that can help grow plants. Because some soils may not sustain a plant that needs to grow. Okay, so I've got it mostly filled up. And now I'm gonna take my seeds. This is a monarch butterfly mix. Please make sure that your seeds are also Florida friendly. You wanna make sure that you're planting plants that are found here in Florida. So I'm shaking in a few seeds. And the package said it only needs to be about one eighth under the surface. So not a lot, an eighth of an inch, excuse me, under the soil. So not a lot, I'm just gonna cover it up lightly. So once you've created your pot, you of course wanna give it a little bit of water and lots of sunshine and you'll start getting some sprouts out of it. And then you can transplant your pot right into the ground or maybe a bigger pot. And eventually the newspaper will biodegrade. So it'll break up and it will become part of the soil and you'll just have your beautiful plants. And that's a way to make your summer more beautiful and green. And if you want more activities like that, you can visit our Summer Challenge page on wfsu.org slash summer challenge. There you can find lots of learning activities to do all summer long and our Summer Challenge checklist. And if you visit a Leroy Collins Leon County Public Library branch starting June 8th, you can pick up a free Summer Challenge bag that has the Summer Challenge checklist in it and all sorts of other activities that you can do all summer long to keep you learning and having fun. See you next time. Mm -hmm.